Hi, my name is Beth Silva and I'm a realtor in Portland, Oregon with Coldwell Banker Barbara Cecile Properties. One of the most common issues with older homes in Portland is underground fuel storage tanks. They're often called oil tanks and it's where the oil is stored for oil furnaces and um, when people used to switch over to natural gas or another source for their heating, they would just leave the tanks empty and consider that the end of the issue. But now we're concerned with contamination and even if a tank has been pumped, there still might be dregs and you know coating on the inside of the tank that can leach out into the surrounding soil and into the surrounding groundwater. And obviously it's a major issue for us here and most Oregonians and Portlanders are very concerned about this. So what people are doing now is getting them decommissioned. And the DEQ certifies certain companies to do the decommissioning and they have to do soil samples. So what does this mean for you? Well as a seller you want to make sure that you don't have an underground fuel storage tank that you don't know about. And so you need to have uh, research on portlandmaps.com to see if you might have one. Or you can get um, a company to come out and do a tank locate. It costs about 100 bucks. They come out with a metal detector and look around for it. And then they can do soil samples. And they test each end of where the tank is uh, and take core samples of the soil and send it up to a lab in Seattle and check on what is in the soil. Make sure there's no diesel fuel in there. Uh, and if you have it, you have to take the tank out and <laughs> clean up all the soil, and it can cost tens of thousands of dollars. And you can have to go into your neighbor's yard, because once a certified company finds out about the oil, they have to follow it until it's completely gone. Um, and as a buyer, you obviously don't want to buy a house that has an oil tank that you don't know about, because in the future, it could be an issue with having to fix it before you can sell again. And just, you know, for environmental ease of mind, you want to make sure you're not buying something and, you know, ruining the earth when you don't know about it. Uh, so you can check out the sites below for more information and definitely talk to your realtor about uh, underground fuel storage tanks and what you can do, what you can look for. Um, if you have an above ground fuel storage tank, it's not that big of a deal. I had one at the house that I purchased and we basically <laughs> drained it and my father-in-law happens to have an oil furnace, so he took the oil and he took the tank and he's going to switch over to that one in a couple of years. And we switched out our furnace. It was expensive, but you know, we don't have to deal with the oil anymore. We don't have to worry about it leaking anywhere. And it makes me happy that my father-in-law is going to switch to an above ground tank so you can monitor it as well. So if you have any more questions, please check out my website, BethSilva.com. Thanks so much.